qualifying for the fall election is just one week away and we're continuing our candidate profiles in the attorney general's race it would be a familiar line of work for this candidate solicitor general liz merle is looking to take her boss's seat next year merle has spent the last seven years under attorney general jeff landry's office as his second in command during that time she has served and argued cases in both state and federal courts including five times before the u.s supreme court she has also led cases against president joe biden's administration including lawsuits focused on COVID-19 mandates. Her most recent cases go before circuit courts in August, one against FEMA's new insurance rating system and the other against big tech's limiting on protected speech. To Merle, every lawsuit against the federal government isn't about latching on to national talking points, but addressing how they impact Louisiana. I can always explain every lawsuit that we have filed and why we filed it and how it threatens our civil liberties here at home or affects us dramatically here at home. The FEMA lawsuit, uh, we have 43 parishes that are part of that lawsuit that joined with us. We have 12 levy boards and 10 states. Um, it is a national program, but it has dramatic impact on us here. And that's true of every issue that comes out of Washington. If Merle were elected, she says she would continue to bring those nationally focused lawsuits, but also take the AG's work with local sheriffs and DAs to the next level. We're not just centrally located in our capacity to support all of our, our sheriffs and, and um, DAs around the state, especially in rural areas, but we have the ability to recruit and keep um, talent that they may not be able to do on a regular basis, and so we just need to bring that expertise to them when they need it because they may not need it all the time, but when they need it, they really need us. Running against Merle are two candidates, State Representative John Stefanski of Crowley and Prosecutor Marty Malley. The primary election is October 14th. And